the Atari VCS game sales have returned, and this time they've kicked it up a notch. What's going on, everyone? It's Rich Haywood here for Bacon Ice Cream Productions and Team RTFC welcoming you to yet another episode of the Good Times Newsline Flashcast. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. So we've got some Atari VCS game deals to go with um, and go over. But first, how are you guys' holiday? Was it good? I mean, I had I had a good time. It was it was great hanging out with the fan. Um, did a live stream yesterday. Actually, opened up some Lorcana cards. It was pretty cool. Um, got some gaming in as well. Yeah, even the old VCS got to turn turn on. We were playing all sorts of fun stuff. It was a good time. It was a good time. So I hope you guys had a good time with your holidays as well. But here, right now, it is time to get into the VCS store and pluck out those game cells, shall we? So um, let's go on and put myself in the box and get this done. Let's go. All right, here I am in the box, and I'm going to cover myself up with the Atari VCS game sales banner. That's right. So let's get into this. I'm going to go from the bottom up, all right? So this time around, listen, folks, listen to this. We've got 83 games, 83 games in the Atari VCS store that are on sale. That's more than half of the available games in the store. And most, if not all, are 50% off or higher. So if you've been waiting to get some deals on Atari VCS games, I think now is the time. So let's go on. Let's go on and uh, and get this going. Um, actually, 84, I missed one. I missed one. Atari VCS Vault 2 for 249 That is not only one that I missed. It's going on the list right now. Uh, which will, I think I'll put that in a description or in the comments or something like that, right? Um, Atari VCS Vault 2 uh, for two forty nine. dollars That's an instant buy, all right? Uh, and also a Rich's pick. So um, if you guys know, the last time we did a sales video, I went through and I, I highlighted some games. I, I went through and just kind of like gave you, um, you know, if I, if I, if I like went into the game, this is a game you should be looking at. This is a game you should be purchasing. All of that kind of stuff. I'm telling you right now, at 249, it's an insta buy. All right. This has uh, 14 arcade games, 16 5200 titles, uh, 12 2600 games um, from the M network, and eight prototype and limited edition homebrew games for the Atari 2600. Um, which some of them are actually also on sale, but we'll get to that in a second. But that's huge. That is huge for 249. That might be. Um, that might be like in it for, uh, like pick of, pick of the, the, the entire video, except for one, because, you know, we're going to get to that in a second too. Um, because man, what a price on that, but just hold on a second, but Atari VCS fall too. Come on, man. 249, pick it up, pick it up. Um, all right. Gun tech two, nine ninety nine. So some of these we're just going to go through and set and say what the price is and I'm going to move on. So gun tech two, nine ninety nine, uh, pretty good price right there. Uh, thrust lander seven forty nine. Again, not bad. Uh, Siggy, a far for, uh, Melusina. Again, awesome price. Um, at two forty nine. Um, that's a, that's a great, it's a great game for, for a, like a really, really cheap. So level lot, another, another cool game. I had a lot of fun with that in the fun for five. Uh, that's $4.99. Um, that's pretty good. Um, then you get to, uh, you skip a whole bunch and then you get to the recharge games. The recharge games have now hit a price point where, where I'm telling you guys, if you have not yet seen this recharge stuff on your VCS, right? If, if that has not graced the VCS, go on. Go get them now. They're four ninety nine. It's five bucks a game on the recharge side on the Tar VCS. If you haven't gotten them yet, it's like I said, five bucks. Come on, just just do it. Um, that's automatic. That's automatic pick central. Um, then you get some seventy eight hundred releases. All right. I told everyone last time if if, if it happened, I would dive in. It did, and I did. Basketball seventy eight hundred. All the seventy eight hundred releases, a dollar forty nine. Uh, in this category, there's a couple others that are a little more high price. We'll get to that in a second. But Basketball 7800 
at $1.49 if you don't have the ROMs and you don't have an Evercade and you want some 7,800 ROMs that aren't included in things like Atari Vault 1 and 2. Um, I think Pascal Brawl is, though, uh, but I'm not sure about Scrapyard Dart or Ninja Golf. Um, but Desert Falcon and Basket Brawl, I think, are in one or two of the vaults. So you might not have to buy doubles. Um, you know, it could be a crazy person like me. Um, but but we've got uh, Basket Brawl, Desert Falcon, Ninja Golf, Scrapyard Dog, and on the other side, Dark Chambers, Motorcycle, and Planet Smashers. They're all $1.49. All of them are $1.49. Um, we've got Black Widow Recharged here at $4.99 again. Pedra. Uh, really cool, like kind of mind bendy uh, puzzle game. It's a two dollars, dollar ninety nine. Great buy, um, definitely recommend it uh, for sure. <clears throat> that is a pick. Um, but going back to Dark Chambers, if you guys do not have this game, if you don't have an Evercade with the dual carts and a VS to unlock this game to to play it that way, and you're looking for a really cool like top down gauntlet like, I'm telling you guys, this game right here. Dark Chambers, get it? It's a dollar forty-nine. All right, it's super cool. It's really, really fun. You can play it for hours and hours and hours. It's not too difficult. Um, uh, highly recommend. Highly, highly, highly recommend this game. And for a dollar forty-nine, come on, you cannot go wrong on here. So, all right, cool. So we go, we go on. Even Food Fight, Food Fight seventy-eight hundred. Uh, the new one just came out. We got a Fun for Five that we're we're a little bit. Uh, behind on Fun for Vibe. Sorry about that, but we're we're catching up. We're catching up. Um, but Food Fight, another awesome game. Um, totally worth it for the uh, for the dollar forty nine price point. Um, Alien Brigade seventy eight hundred, Asteroid seventy eight hundred, Fatal Fatal Run seventy eight hundred, Centipede seventy eight hundred, Real Sports Baseball seventy eight hundred, all on sale dollar forty nine. Um, so so that's pretty cool. You can add those to the collection. Now some of those again are in the Vault Vault One and Vault Two. So. You know, your mileage may vary. If you have an Evercade, again, your mileage may vary, that kind of thing. So there's that. Um, don't want to skip over Asteroid Recharge. Asteroid Recharge is also $4.99. Um, so definitely check that out. Um, you've got the DOS Box games. The DOS Box games are on sale. So if you're looking for, now, important, important message, message and information here, all right? Some are compatible with game controllers and the mouse and keyboard. Some are compatible only with mouse and keyboard, so keep that compatibility aside. If you don't have a mouse, mouse and keyboard for your Atari VCS, nor do you want to use a mouse and keyboard to control games on the Atari VCS, be careful with these games. They're three forty nine, so super cheap. But also, be careful, be careful, be careful, because you might buy a game that you don't, you know, you want to use the modern controller and you can't because it's not compatible. So just mileage may vary here. So um, on them, I think. I think it's Harrier Jump Jet. Yep, Harrier Jump Jet is one of the ones that is only available for mouse and keyboard. Um, so, uh, so, so keep that in mind. And then uh, Crusade in uh, Europe, I think, is the other one there. So there you go. Um, is only available for mouse and keyboard. So, so mileage may vary there. Uh, if you don't want to you know, jump in and do that, don't worry. Um, uh, we got you covered there. Um, and again, you know, it's cheap, cheap stuff, cheap stuff. Uh, don't want to go over Breakout Recharged and and um, and gloss over that one either. Still a great game, four ninety nine. Again, all the recharged games are four ninety nine. Um, it's it's pretty awesome. We go to Tempest four thousand. So we're starting to get to the nine ninety nine and higher uh, price points. Still a great price though. It's fifty percent off. Uh, I think it was nineteen ninety nine when it first came out. Um, so that's pretty awesome. Um, Combinera um, is a as a richest pick. Um, it's an awesome game, and it now hit 749. So 749 is a great price uh, for that really cool, bit, like mind bendy puzzle game. Uh, definitely check it out. It's pretty cool. Gravatar Recharged again 499. Again, all the recharged games are 499. Can't go wrong. Caddy and Batty, The Spirit Guide at 249. Um, not bad. But then we get to another one at 249. Come on, guys. Donut Dodo again. If you guys love arcade style games, do not sleep on this game. It's two forty nine. If you didn't pick it up the last time when it was on sale for like three something, what was on sale last for? Last time it was on sale for three dollars and seventy five cents in November. It is now down to two forty nine. Um, come on, guys, just pick it up. Just pick it up. Uh, BPM Boy um, has now hit the magic price point of nine ninety nine. It was on sale for fourteen ninety nine last time. 
so that's a good that's a good uh, price drop. Uh, you want to go ahead and pick up that one. It's a pretty cool game. Um, Meganoid and Alpaloon 2 uh, from our friends over at uh, Orange Pixel. Um, that they have hit. Uh, Meganoid is 4.49 and Alpaloon 2 is 3.99 respectively. Um, so those are also pretty cool games. Uh, to go ahead and check them out again, Yars Recharge. It's a recharge game. It's 4.99. Go for it. Got some 2600 games, Aqua Venture, Saboteur, and uh, Yars Return. They've all hit 149. Um, so if you wanted to, you know, pick something up, the only thing that I think is not on a vault is Saboteur. And Saboteur is an awesome game. It's a Howard Scott Warshaw uh, game. If you guys haven't played that, uh, definitely, definitely check that out. That's Saboteur 2600 for a dollar 49. Space Grunts is next at 749. Uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, it's a pretty cool game and a pretty cool price. Atari Mania. Has dropped all the way down to 12.49, uh, which is a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool game. I still haven't gotten uh, too far. Those bosses, man, they they really get me, and I, I really got to go that go through and like I don't know, I, I just I really got to go through and like work on those games uh, to get better at them. Here's a loot, great game, um, and it's hit the 4.49 price point, which is pretty awesome. Missile Command recharged, of course. It's a recharge game. It's the new one. It's the new version. It's not the old one. Um, that's uh, that's not so great. Um, the new one is really, really cool. Definitely uh, encourage you guys to check that out. It's 4 dollars um, Gunslugs. Um, and it's also a richest pick, I should say. Um, as, it, as is Yards Recharged. Uh, forgot to forgot to mention that. Um, Gunslugs um, at $4.49 um, is, a, is a cool cool game at a cool price. But then we hit it. We hit it, folks. You guys got to look at this one. If you do not have Atari 50 on your Atari VCS, again, if you do not have Atari 50 on your Atari VCS, all right, it's $14.99. It's $14.99, 15 bucks for quite possibly the greatest ever compilation of retro games in a single title. It is so good. If you guys do not have this yet, there is no excuse. It's $15. Just, just do it. It's cheaper than an Evercade game. And they just put out an update to put in, like, what is it, 12 or 13 more games for free? Come on, guys. Come on. You've got to get in on that. It's, it is, that is by far the coolest one. The most highlighted title I could do is the ultimate richest pick in the entire, VC, in the entire VCS store. If you're going to get one game out of the sale and you don't have it already, it's Atari 50. Just grab it, especially at $14.99. All right. Cool. Enough of that. All right, we go on to Residual at $6.49, not bad. Not a bad price for a really cool game. Aka R, um, the uh, Jeff Mentor game, is also a richest pick. At $9.99, it's, a, it's, got, a, it's got a really cool uh, dive in and grab it price. Um, another richest pick, uh, Path to the Princess at $1.99. Come on, you got you to go. You got to go for it. Um, you know, if you're not if you're not into paying the the nine ninety nine for uh, for Aka R and you want something like you're looking for the super cheap games, there's one for you at a dollar ninety nine. Path to the Princess is a cool game for Mechan Games. It's our friends over at Mechan Games. All right, um, Caverns of Mars Recharge again. The Recharge games five bucks. Come on, pick it up. Um, the Berserk twenty six hundred um, is a another one of those twenty six hundred games. It's hit a dollar forty nine, which is pretty cool, um, and it is quite possibly well, not quite possibly. It is in my top five 2,600 games of all time. Uh, love that game. It's, it's a good time. All right. Gunslugs 2 at 449. Um, as is Heroes of Loot 2. Some more games over from the Orange Pixel crew. Um, it's pretty good. Those are pretty good stuff. Heroes of Loot 2, I think, if I was going to pick which Orange Pixel game is my favorite, it's probably going to be Heroes of Loot 2 um, because I think it's really fun. Um, it's, uh, it's getting, again, got like that top down, like cool, uh, new ish indie kind of feel for it. Um, it's pretty cool stuff. Um, and if you're into that, into that kind of thing, definitely pick that up. But if you only have time for one, I would say, sorry, orange pixel, I'd go dark chambers anyway, uh, because dark chambers is such a good game in my opinion. Um, and hat tip to my buddy Pete, the ever Canadian himself. Uh, for uh, illuminating that game to me, because I never knew that that existed. I played Atari for years and years and years, never had a copy of Dark Chambers on 2600, and never had it on 7800 either. Um, but both are great games, and uh, the 7800 gets the edge because it looks better and sounds better and all kind of stuff. So, cool. We move on to Escape from Popo, which is also on sale. 
another one of those uh, Mechan games, uh, cool car, awesome stuff uh, for three forty nine. dollars Can't beat that. Um, Skinny and Franco. Now, this is a game. I know it's a little controversial for me on the on the Bacon Ice Cream channel to be talking about Skinny and Franco because I, you know, like it was so crazy that I actually didn't show any footage of the game um, while I was in the Fun for Five mode um, for it. But it's not like it's not cool. They've been updating it like crazy. Um, and even though it might not be my cup of tea uh, for you guys, um, it might have hit that price point. We might finally jump in on it. It was pretty expensive when it first came out. I think it was almost $27 or $28 or something like that. It's now down to $14.24. So come on. If you're looking for like a huge beat-em-up um, that really kind of crosses that like GTA-ish line, um, like hyper MA, um, you know, like really, 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 really like adult stuff, um, you can you can check that one out. Again, it's $14.24. Um, but don't expect to see uh, footage on this channel of that game. Um, just, you know, putting that out there. Anyway, we've got Alien Abduction 2600 on sale for $6.74. Getting closer to that, like, okay, cool, like, just hop in and do that, unless you're a super fan of the people that made it. Um, why so expensive? It's a brand new game for 2600 um, from a developer that's been that's been really, really cool. Um, <clears throat> John Van Ryzen. Um, he's worked on a whole bunch of other games in the past, um, and uh, you know this was like one of his. You know, think of it as a brand, just a brand new ROM. Uh, so instead of it being a ROM that you can get anywhere else on a cartridge and play on your twenty six hundred plus or whatever, this is pretty much I think the only place you can play it outside of maybe Atari Age. Um, so and it's cool. It's on sale six six dollars seventy four cents if you're sleeping on it before and you wanted to pick it up because it was you know like hey I just want to wait for it to come down. It did. And it's on sale, so you can go ahead and check that out right there. We've got Avian Knights, um, and that has hit the $9.99 price point. It is also a Rich's pick. Um, the reason why is because it's this like really hyper cool, like gauntletly kind of thing. Um, and it's got like all these different updates. These guys have been going nuts um, at Allen One. They've been they've been doing update after update after update. They're doing like esports stuff on this game. Uh, which is really uncommon to see, especially on a VCS. Um, it's really kind of cool uh, to see what they're doing, and they keep updating the game over and over and over again. Um, so it might be worth it to jump in. And again, it's got that price point, uh, which is not so bad either at $9.99, so you, know, you can hop on in. Yeah, Groundskeeper 2 uh, at $4.49, not a bad game. Another one of those from Orange Pixel. Um, it's pretty good stuff. You got Doodle Taxi. Doodle Taxi at $3.99. <clears throat> again, in my opinion... It's a must-buy. You gotta grab it. It's one of those things. Come on, I love I love making games. My game, my buddy Khan, he's been doing awesome stuff. <clears throat> and this game is really cool. It is my son's favorite Atari VCS game. I'm just yes, my son Douglas. It is his. It is 100%. If the Atari VCS goes on, that's the title he asks. Can I play some Doodle Taxi? He loves car games, and he definitely loves this one. It's super fun. And it hit the must-buy price point. I, in my opinion, $3.99. Come on, if you guys don't already have this one, go on, go on, pick it up. Um, if you like things like like Crazy Taxi, you're not gonna be disappointed. The the update that added the entire city, that that whole second city thing, um, it's so awesome. I'm gonna go in here and, and show you guys. Like you get, yeah, it's like uh, it's this really cool artwork aesthetic. It's super super neat. Um, as you get. As you get your fares done, like the, the world starts like coloring itself. It's part of the storyline, but um, it's super super neat. Um, Khan did an amazing job putting in a whole bunch of, of effort into this game, so definitely check it out. Um, you're looking for something a little um, a little on the lighter side, still with car stuff, and almost like a puzzle game. Mechan's Trapping Mission for a dollar forty nine is another pickup because um, again, come on, it's like the, these are now the cheapest full titles that aren't ROMs. At a dollar forty nine, you know, you're just like looking to pad the collection a little bit. Uh, not so bad. Um, you know, go ahead and pick that up, and that's a that, a, that is a richest pick there. Um, <clears throat> then we got some more seventy eight hundred games. Seventy eight hundred uh, fail safe at two forty nine. These are newer ROMs uh, that were a, a Atari age ROMs that were created and then put out on the VCS later. Um, there's a couple more that are coming up that are really cool that are also on sale, so um, you can check that out. At 249, yeah, tournament. Uh, tournament is 399. Um, is a pretty cool game. 
um, and definitely something worth checking out. Mr. Run and Jump has now come down to twelve forty nine. Um, that's this one again was like I think it was twenty five bucks when it came out. So at half off, uh, if you guys don't already have it, definitely something to check out. Um, this game here is another one of those games from uh, from Atari directly, but also from the same developer as Combinera. Um, you got that cool, like neon, jumpy, like hard as nails aesthetic going on. So if you're into that, the, that kind of thing, definitely check this game out. It's pretty cool. Um, definitely worth the, uh, definitely worth, in my opinion, it's definitely worth it. Um, <clears throat> and does indeed get the pick at this particular price point. Um, so another one that is also a pick, of course, is every single recharge game. Uh, Quantum Recharge um, at the $4.99 price point. Definitely something worth picking up. <clears throat> Definitely a cool game for sure. Uh, we got Tilting Tiles, another cool little puzzle game. Um, that's at $2.49. Not bad. Uh, and uh, not bad at, uh, on the price point either. You got Biolab Wars. Now, Biolab Wars is another one of those that's in that is was already a, a pick at the full price, but at $2.99, at three bucks. Come on, guys. You got to hop into this one. It's, it's that like Contra like. It's super, super cool, super, super awesome. Um, definitely check this one out. And at three bucks, um, again, it's worth it's worth the pickup um, for sure. Um, really, really fun. And we did a fun for five on that. You guys can check that out. We fun for five basically every game until we get to the newer stuff um, where it started to slip off a little. But we will catch up again in 2024. Ultimate ski jumping at $4.99. Um, not bad. And if you're into that kind of like cool little – um, this is almost like a, it's, it's almost like a, uh, like a gravity simulator, um, you know, game. I, like it's, it is a sports game. Yes, you are jump, you know, ski jumping, but there's other games that are kind of in this genre where you're like floating around and, and they're like aiming and doing trajectory and like that kind of stuff, it's like worms and like that kind of stuff. So if you're into that thing, uh, definitely give it a whirl, uh, at the five, at the five dollar price point. It's not bad. It's an easy jump in, um, <clears throat> Neo Sprint has now been on sale, uh, which is pretty cool. So there's some new newer games that weren't on sale last time that are not on sale now, and is also a pick uh, for me at the price point. So it's seven seven forty nine, worth it to check it out. They've been doing pretty cool things with it. It's still in that open alpha or open beta or whatever it is, um, early access I guess is what they're calling it. Um, but definitely something to check out, um, and uh, and a not a bad price point at all. We got the gem collector at a dollar forty nine. Um, Another game, if you're looking to pad in, it's definitely a pick. It's a really cool puzzle game. Uh, very, very cool. Days of Doom. Now, this is the one I've been waiting for. I've been waiting to play it, and I still haven't actually gotten to play it, but it looks so, so cool. I bought it at full price. It's now half off at $14.99. Um, definitely a pick for me. Um, you know, if you're into those kind of style games, it's it looks super, super cool. This is another one by Atari, um, and it looks really, really neat. I can't wait to like dig in and uh, and play this game. And I want to say, um, yeah, it's a sneaky box game. So the guys that have been doing all of that hard work on those recharge games, this is something a little different from them. So if you want to like check out like tactical RPG action um, with the guys that have been doing all the recharge games, definitely something to check out. So awesome stuff. Seven forty nine for sit cymatically muffed, which was a pretty cool game. It's like that top down, like cool little thing. Um, definitely uh, not for everyone, but a a cool game nonetheless. Planetary Defense Force, which was another cool game. Um, definitely gave me some like super stardust kind of vibes. Um, definitely a neat neat game at two ninety nine, worth checking out. As is Super Star Shooter sixteen, um, which had that epic commercial um, that uh, was a Kaz. Uh, Kaz Productions or Kraz Productions um, was involved in. Um, super cool. I love the adver advertisement for it, but the, sh the shooter itself is also like really, really cool. It's got like that kind of like that that trippy um, that trippy aesthetic, um, almost almost like a vector graphics kind of thing. Um, very, very cool. Very cool stuff. Haunted House, another Atari game on sale, uh, half off, nine ninety nine. Uh, so if you missed it the first time. Uh, during the holidays or whatever, and you wanted to pick it up now, come on, that's $9.99. It's very good stuff. You've got EXO and ARTI at $7,800. Those are both $6.74, which is also half off. So <clears throat> with those games, these are also new homebrew ROMs that have been made pretty recently. 
that have been converted and uh, allowed to play here on the VCS. Awesome stuff. Love seeing this stuff, kind of stuff coming out on the VCS. Please, please, please get some more stuff like that coming out. Like even games like Game Panic, um, uh, Game Panic Three, and the other um, the other games from um, John Hancock um, and all that kind of stuff. Even Strike Zone uh, 2600. Would have loved to see this one on sale too, uh, to be honest. But um, you know, hey, it's already it's already a pretty good stuff, a pretty good time. And Strike Zone was awesome because they even updated it. Uh, so even though this is not on sale, just put Strike Zone on your list anyway, um, because they updated it for each holiday, um, and uh, you know put out the update and then changed all the graphics, which is really cool. It's really neat that uh, the homebrew guys are really doing this. I'm, I'm very impressed, um, and uh, had a lot of really good times with it. So so um, like I said, those those seventy eight hundred dollars, uh, seventy eight hundred games at six dollars and seventy four cents are also a pretty good time. Basket Boom, another one from Mech Game Games, hitting 249 price point, which is pretty cool. Um, you got Berserk Recharged at um, at 499, which is cool because it's a pretty new game and it's now hit the price point where hey, if you want to jump in or you're just trying to collect all the recharge games at five bucks, come on, jump on in. Savage Halloween, huge pick, huge, huge, huge pick. This game is awesome. Uh, any price point. But right now at two ninety nine, it's I know it's not Halloween. Doesn't matter. Just grab this game. Just grab it. It's so much fun. Um, it's another one of those run and gun kind of sh like shoot 'em up games. It's so much fun, guys. Like just just hop on in and and go for it. Montezuma's Revenge <clears throat> at six dollars and seventy four cents. It is another pretty cool one. Um, if you guys are fans of that game um, or didn't pick up the round last time, again, it's I think it's again half off. So jump on in on that one blue kid two and one are both five dollars and 24 cents another cool uh thing that you can jump in on uh not so bad stardash um at four nine four forty nine pretty good stuff you got battle rockets at five dollars and million greg which actually just came out i think a week ago two weeks ago something like that um it's a cool little platformer um, at two ninety nine. Haven't haven't checked it out yet, but this definitely has that vibe. Where man, if this wasn't on, like it isn't on Evercade, but like man, you could see this being on an Indie Heroes, right? Like, come on. Um, so I can't wait to check that out and uh, and have some fun with that. And that is it, guys. Those are the titles. Those are the titles for uh, the holiday sale. Um, like I said, eighty four games. Eighty four games, guys. Um, that is pretty, pretty nuts. It is definitely more than half the store. Um, we got tons of different picks. Uh, so let's go into the wrap up and we'll, we'll go over some of these more picks here and, uh, and get this thing done here. Let's go. All right, guys, what a deal. And here it is. This is the one. This is the one. If you guys aren't getting anything, it's better be Atari 50. Right? You guys are getting one thing. Better be Atari 50 if you don't already have it. Um, but other huge picks. I'm only going to do the three-star picks that I want to do. Um, you guys can scrub through and find my other picks uh, if you want. But Atari VCS Vault, th Vault 2, definitely um, got to get it. Dark Chamber, 7800. Um, so Vault 2 was 249 so for a collection of a whole bunch of games, that's basically an Evercade cart for two dollars and forty nine. Come on, just jump on in and grab it if you does don't already have it. Um, Seventy eight hundred Dark Chambers um, for a dollar forty nine, done, ready to rock. Um, you've got Donut Dodo at two forty nine. Uh, again, another huge game that's really really awesome. Um, Atari fifty at fourteen ninety nine is probably the clear winner of the sale. It's just so good. It's such a such a great game and such an awesome price. Um, definitely worth checking out there. Doodle Taxi at three ninety nine, and Avian Knights at nine ninety nine. Um, another two games that are really really I think you know worth your time, worth your worth your uh, your money to check out. And then Savage Halloween, ha like rounding out that whole thing at two ninety nine. Um, is such a fun game and it's one of my favorites of the 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 latest crop of games to come out. Um, now there are so many more that I still need to play. Like, for example, I still haven't played Days of Doom on a on a uh, on a Fun for Five. We still have to Fun for Five EXO and ARTI uh, seventy eight hundred. 
Um, we've still got to do Blue Kid 2. Um, we still got to do Battle Rockets, Millie and Greg. Um, Food Fight, Culinary Combat, a game that I tested with, uh, with um, uh, which we call it, with uh, Mega Cat, um, which, was a, which was a pretty cool game um, when I was playing it. Now, now we got to find out what's going on with the, the full release. Madness Beverage from the guys that made... Um, uh, which we call it, um, Skinny and Franco, and the Perplexing Orb Bounce and Roll, which is another game from the same uh, the same developer, Treefall Studios, um, who did um, one of the other puzzle games down here. Uh, it was either Petra or Tilting Tiles. I think it was Tilting Tiles they did. Um, it was it was Tilting Tiles, which is also on sale for two forty nine. So um, so if you if you wound up picking up um, the uh, Perplexing Orb bounce and roll and you wound up liking that one and you were like oh i wonder if they did anything else they did um they did another game it's tilting tiles so you can pick up that one too and that's it that's all i got for you guys Oof. it was a half hour going through 84 games on sale we did it and also you know what else happened if you guys were watching there wasn't a price on any one of those games not one not one so of the 139 titles listed on the Atari VCS store, that's right. You know what that means. It means that this guy has got them all. I got them all. So um, so you know what we're going to have to do after that? We're going to have to go through. We're either going to have to have a mega stream where I start playing as, much, as many of them as possible. Um, but I think for the new year, I think it is time that we might have to do some rankings. You might have to, because now I got them all. And if you got them all, then you got to put them in orders, right? You got to list them. You got to do something, right? So let me know down below if you in the comments if you're liking those kind of things. If you're if you want to see this face, talk to you about those kind of things. Put them in lists. Do whatever. Uh, highlight some stuff. <clears throat> you know, uh, revisit revisit some games that we've already uh, fun for vibe. Because uh, it's getting big. The library's getting pretty, pretty, pretty big. So I want to make sure that there's stuff that doesn't fall through the cracks. We just all talk, talk about the new stuff and all that. I want to make sure that we bring up some more games um, that are deep cuts. Uh, because a lot of these devs out here, the, a, lot of the, a lot of these guys, if they're trying real hard. They're putting out, <clears throat> they're putting out their stuff on the uh, on the systems. And I want to make sure that they don't get buried on here as we get more titles. Now, more titles, definitely. Please, 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 please make sure that they they're uh, coming over here to the Atari VCS. We want a live vibrant community of games and game developers coming over here and making games um but we also want you know want to make sure that like hey you know those those games that are down there down below on the bottom of the list um they're cool games too and you should be checking them out so i want to make sure that we spotlight those two here on bacon ice cream productions so again let me know down below if you want me to go ahead and do that now we have reached of course the end of the video here on bacon ice cream productions we have to thank some people right we have to do one thing one thing only let's thank them and let's do that right now and who are, who are we thinking of course the members of the good times club because i brains <laughs> uh so we thank the ever canadian crimson cross george games chris westerman phantom fiction skeletrex lidar gem papa p the intellivision gamer ken liqueur mr shua john willig and gunzy 20 all for being members of the good times club thank you guys so much for your support because of your support, things like 1080p StreamYard, the ability to do all these videos uh, in a pretty awesome awesome and, and efficient way for you guys, all thanks to them. Um, there are those really awesome pushes to do really cool other content. That's also all them. You know, the, they, they vote in the background. They're basically our board here at Bacon Ice Cream Productions. You can even join them, too. You hit the button. Hit the little join button there if you want. You know, and, and come in and have the fun. Um, there's some exclusive content that they get uh, for being a Good Times Club member. Um, and, of course, you know, like exclusive voting rights and all that kind of stuff. Um, and, um, and of course, extreme gratitude from, from me to you guys and, and the rest of the Bacon Ice Cream crew um, to you guys for, for helping us do all this cool content. So with all that being said, we will catch you next time for some good times. I'm Rich, and we will see you later, and sooner than later, I might add, because we are about to get into all this kind of stuff. I mean, all the holidays are over, all the crunch is over, all the business is starting to subside. Now it's time to dine on all these cool games with you guys. So keep it locked right here, and we'll catch you next time. See ya.
team, rtsc.baconicecream.com.